What's good my friends? Welcome back to another video and in today's video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get custom letters to your achievement showcase on your Steam profile. So the way this works is actually very simple. All you need to do is find a game that has the achievement style that you want and then you have to simply unlock the achievements for that game. You don't have to worry about actually playing the game. I'll show you guys how to unlock all the achievements very quickly. So overall this video is gonna be composed of three separate parts. The first part is gonna be choosing your letter style. The second part is going to be actually unlocking the achievements and the third part is setting the showcase to your profile. So I'll go ahead and put the timestamps up on screen right now if you just want to fast forward to a specific part. Before we get too much in depth, I do also want to let you guys know that you need to be at least level 10 on Steam in order to have an open showcase slot to actually display the achievements. If you're not level 10, um, I do own a website that I'll also link down below in the description that can get you to level 10 for under $2. So let's get started. First things first, go down into the description and open up one of the two guys that I'm going to have linked. Here, you can clearly see some of the different types of achievements for different types of games. What you need to do is then simply scroll through some of these guides and choose a text style that you think is going to match your profile the most. This is the game that we're going to go ahead and need to buy. After scrolling through some of these guides, I've decided that I'm going to purchase this game called Zup9. I really like to look at the achievements and I think they'd match perfectly with my profile. So once you have your chosen game, simply go ahead and purchase it. I'm just going to go ahead and fast forward this part. Luckily, the game that I bought was actually on sale, so I was able to get it for under a dollar. After you have your game purchased, all we have to do is unlock the achievements for the game. To do that, we're going to go ahead and use this app called Steam Achievement Manager. So I'm going to have this link down below in the description. So go ahead to the description and click on the link to get to this page. Then let's go ahead and click on the file labeled Steam Achievement Manager .zip to download it. Note that there may be a newer version for you, so the numbers may not exactly be the same, but that's all right. Once it's done downloading, we need to simply extract the file into a folder. Then simply click on the file labeled sam.picker.exe to open it. As you can see, it should open up this little page and it should automatically pull all of the Steam games that you currently have. Next, we need to simply find the game that we want to unlock the achievements for. In my case, it's going to go ahead and be Zup9. So I'm going to scroll all the way down until I can find it and then I'm going to go ahead and double click on its icon. Once it's fully opened, let's click on the button that says unlock all achievements. And after that, let's click on this other button that says commit changes to save it to Steam. Now, if you go back to your profile and take a look, you should see that all the achievements for that game have actually been unlocked. Finally, we simply need to set the achievement showcase to our profile. To do this, let's navigate back to our profile. Let's click edit profile. Let's click featured showcase and let's navigate to an open showcase slot. Let's click on it and then click achievement showcase. Then click on this little panel thing, choose your game. In my case, it was up nine and let's go ahead and wait for all the achievements to load. Note this can take some time if there's a lot of achievements for the game and then simply click again to set the achievement. Now, all we have to do is repeat the process for the remaining letters. And once you're all done, let's scroll all the way down. Let's click save. And let's go back to our profile to see the result. And as you can see, we now have a custom letter achievement showcase to our Steam profile. So that's going to go ahead and conclude the video. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Um, only 2% of you who watch my videos subscribe. So please subscribe. But uh, other than that, I guess I'll see you on the next one.